that was a language. <laughs> the flowers were just a thank you is all. <laughs> I guess one's a meaningless gesture and the other is flowers. <laughs> I talked to my sister about dating now. I have a sister, and she's, uh, she's a couple of years younger than I am, so I talked to my sister about dating. I say, why am I constantly getting dumped for things like flowers? And my sister tells me, ladies, see if you agree, my sister tells me that I need, if I'm dating, to play off a woman's insecurities. What do you think? She says that if I meet a woman, I have to like sort of look at her and then not pay attention to her, just give her incidental eye contact and ignore her so that she gets all upset with me and goes, well, hey, why isn't he talking to me? I got, you know, why isn't he talking to me? So then she'll approach me and give me her phone number, but then I'm not allowed to use that phone number because, again, if I call her, I go from being a priority to an option really quickly. So I've got to continue to play this game somehow where I hold on to the phone number for a few days and arrange to somehow accidentally bump into her. And then when I do, she'll get all pissed at me and go, why haven't you called yet? Well, finally, there's my permission slip. Now I can get all excited and, you know, oh, yeah. go home and call her and like, woo, you know, the phone's ringing. I, I might get a date out of this. Woo, I might, I might have sex with something other than woo for a change. I don't know. And, and the phone is ringing and I'm excited and the phone ringing and I'm excited and then and then mom answers because I, I didn't know she was 13 and still living at home because I don't know it's yeah I maybe <laughs> oh I should have figured it out when I was buying all the cookies from her yes but I saw <laughs> No, I'm saying I saw the uniform and I thought, oh, military, no, brownie, that's not right. Yeah, no, I, I don't like that, I was just confused. But here's the, here's the funny part, this mom laughed too. Mom said, oh, well, you thought my daughter was of age, I'm single, do you want to meet me? <laughs> yeah, I do, why not? I'm desperate. So I meet mom in a public area, daytime coffee shop, just to go meet, and, and, and mom is gorgeous. Mom is gorgeous. Well, I've, I've been talking to my sister about insecurities and playing mind games, and I have a woman that was brave enough to hit on me sight unseen, had a sense of humor about me hitting on her daughter, and is gorgeous. Well, now I'm in my head going, what the hell's wrong with her? There's got to be something messed up up here, right? But I'll talk to her. I'll find out what's going on. And she, well, it turns out she has some insecurities. She, she felt bad because uh, she was a single parent. She's not sure if I would find that flawed, but I don't. I'm fine with that. Uh, she felt bad. She, she was embarrassed by this. She had been in a car accident, had an operation, colostomy bag. She thought, I thought that was cool because I'm a single guy, right? <laughs> oh, no one. I'm a single guy. It makes my sex life a lot easier. I used to have to go all the way to third base to get stink finger. Now it's just a well placed hug. Oh, it's right. There's no more diving involved. Look at the shirt. Now too much. <laughs> I've never heard that joke, and I had to do something now on the CD. And anybody thinks that's gross, you can talk to her. It's her fault. Gross. I know it's gross. You know what? I'm sorry. I don't mean, I'm usually not this filthy, but I just, you know, it's, it's, that, it's that insecurity thing where I've got people here that I'm supposed to impress, and so then I feel all self conscious, like, oh, they're here, just, you know, whatever, and so I feel, so then I go really dirty, immature. But I will apologize. I, stink fingers, it's a dirty term, and it's wrong, and late, I know. I, now you're coming here, I feel bad, sweetheart. I'm so sorry. But you know who feels worse when I say stink finger? You know who feels worse? Every man in here. Every man in here feels worse. Because every man in here, every guy in here, flashes back to high school when I say it. Every man in here goes back to high school and thinks of that one friend they had, that one friend who was an asshole. So when we'd be walking in the hallway, if we got a little something something the night before, we'd come up to us and be like, dude, check it out, stink finger. Oh, no, no, that's not. Because I remember when it would happen to me. I remember. I would get so pissed off. I would not say, damn, that's inappropriate. 